Hey y'all, Tanny Cooks here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make an absolutely delicious recipe in your air fryer. So I'm gonna show you how to cook hot dogs in your air fryer. Now, it is May 2023, so it's quite likely that one day rain might change your plans for your cookout. And if that happens, you can cook your hot dogs indoors instead of outdoors. I'm gonna show you a couple of different ways you can do it. You can cook your hot dogs from frozen in your air fryer, or you can cook them from a thawed out state. Now, I do want to say first, though, before we get into the recipe, some people may want to comment on this video and say, I don't eat hot dogs because they're not healthy. Thank you for telling me. Some people might say, I don't eat hot dogs because I know what's in them. Thank you for telling me. Some people say, I don't eat hot dogs because I eat organic and I only eat healthy and this is too much fat and too much sodium. Thank you for telling me. This video is for people who are interested to see how you can cook hot dogs in your air fryer. So let's get to cooking. <laughs> I'm using these beef hot dogs Kirkland brand that I got from Costco. It's a 24 ounce pack. These are the nutrition facts if you're interested in that. But I am cooking these because my family likes them. Now I like beef for this recipe instead of smoked turkey franks because the white meat, it just doesn't cook up the same way and have the same visual appeal. So you can see how they look when I first put them in. But they'll taste good, but it's up to you if you use beef or turkey franks. So beef franks have enough fat and they will crisp up the way I want them. So I'm just putting them in my air fryer and you want to try and get it to a single layer. I'm cooking these thawed out hot dogs on 400 degrees for nine minutes, which is the same amount of time I would use for frozen hot dogs. What we're gonna do is let this cook for the first five minutes at 400 degrees. Open your air fryer and see how they look. Do you wanna eat them at this point? They're probably already heated all the way through, but I like a little more color on my hot dogs. So after about another minute or two, I open my air fryer again and it's starting to look the way that I like. You can see the fat is glistening and you can hear the sizzle. So now they've cooked for a total of seven minutes and I'm checking once again. I absolutely recommend when you're cooking something in the air fryer for the first time to check it every few minutes or at least halfway through to see at what point is your food cooked the way you want it to be. And look at these hot dogs, y'all. They almost look like they were grilled on a charcoal grill. Of course, we won't have the delicious charcoal flavor, but in a pinch, this is a very delicious option. So I cook mine for nine minutes, and then I place them in buns and top them with mustard, relish, red onions. I left one plain, and I added ketchup on the last one. Let me know down below, what is your favorite topping for hot dogs? I know somebody's gonna say chili, but I didn't make it on this day, so. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. 